Are you scared that AI will replace you at your job? Well, in this video, I'll cover top 7 skills that will stay in demand for the foreseeable future. My name is Akash and for those of you who are new to the channel, I'm a software engineer working at Microsoft. As per reports of Levels.FYI, from the year 2022 to 2024, there has been about 471,000 layoffs in the tech industry. And it is nature to have fear of being on the next round. There's an interesting fact in the report of World Economic Forum that states that about 50% of all employees will need to reskill by 2025. And 2025 is just eight or nine months away. So it is important that you stay up to date with the latest technologies and learn the skills that are in demand. To get notified about similar video, please hit subscribe button. Before we get started, I want to point out that the purpose of this video is not to advise you to switch roles or learn a new language or a framework. Instead, I'll be covering skills that will truly make you irreplaceable at your job. First skill that I want to cover is basic data analysis and statistics. Now hear me out. As I said before, I'm not recommending that you switch your job profile to become a data analyst, data scientist, or a machine learning engineer. Instead, focus on mastering basic data processing, manipulation, and interpretation skills. In today's world, every solution that you will implement will collect data in form of logs, monitoring, and usage. Having basic data analysis and statistics skill will help you make data-driven decisions for the product that you're working on. And ability to back up your idea with the evidence in data will significantly improve your credibility at work. For example, you can use data to determine the shortcoming of the existing feature or create spec for the new feature that will help stakeholders. And I would highly recommend learning basic visualization tools to complement your data analysis skills. For example, you can spend a day learning about basics of Power BI or Tableau. Even as a beginner, you'll be able to create stunning visualizations with this tool that will further improve your reputation at work. Next, I wanna talk about leadership and soft skills. Tech sector is increasingly becoming a collaborative environment. Being able to communicate with stakeholders and your team member will be essential to be successful at your job. Having skill to translate business requirement into technical requirement using communication will help save time and resources for the organization. And it will foster an environment where you as a team will be able to solve complex problems. Communication skills can help you resolve conflicts and create an inclusive product that can be used by anyone. Apart from that, being able to influence without authority is also a very valuable skill. It will help you lead complex projects and showcase your trustworthiness and reliability to the organization. And of course, having ability to lead will boost team's productivity and it will help coach the individuals to grow and contribute in the organization. Third, I want to talk about coding and problem solving skills. I know as a tech professional, you'll be surprised to hear this. It is easy to write code for small user base, but scaling the same code and design for the large user base is a whole new skill. Today's AI system will help you write code that can work for small user base and simple product. However, integrating and debugging code still requires human assistance. At the moment, AI requires highly specific prompts to be able to generate good results. And writing prompts for the complex project is not feasible. So being able to integrate your code into complex system with efficiency is still highly sought after skill. Moreover, writing code that keeps security, readability, and best practices in consideration is still a challenging task. Next, I want to talk about productivity automation. Productivity automation is a way to automate repetitive tasks. Ability to identify processes that can be automated can help drive significant impact. For example, if you're able to automate a task that takes one hour of engineer's time every week, then for a team of 10 engineers, you can save about 520 hours worth of effort every year and this one automation can be enough to cover average engineers yearly salary automation can help reduce trivial mistakes and streamline quality into repetitive process and organizations can focus on solving the challenges that matter it is estimated that productivity automation will help save about 25 billion dollars by 2027 as per reports of grandview research fifth let's talk about cybersecurity. like i said before you do not have to become a cybersecurity analyst but rather focus on learning the privacy and security fundamentals. With the rise in digital threats, cybersecurity has become paramount. Protecting sensitive data and system is crucial to any organization. By learning cybersecurity fundamentals, you'll be able to safeguard against cybersecurity attacks and contribute to a secure digital environment. Skills like network security, encryption, and threat detection are in high demand. And having basic knowledge of cybersecurity can help your employer fill the gap. Moreover, you'll be able to create secure products that can help win stakeholders' trust and hence build your reputation. Moving on to the sixth skill, cloud computing. Cloud technology is the backbone of modern IT infrastructure. Understanding cloud platforms 
like Azure, AWS, and Google Cloud can supercharge your career. With cloud computing skills, you can deploy scalable solutions, optimize resource usage, and ensure high availability. Most computer science degrees do not teach about deploying software and websites in a scalable manner. And as a matter of fact, there's a site called Missing Semester that focuses on a lot of the skills that we covered today. So check it out to learn more about these critical skills. And at last, let's explore AI interactions. AI is transforming the way we interact with technology from virtual assistants to chatbots. AI-driven interfaces are becoming increasingly common. In near future, AI will be integrated into all softwares and applications that you'll be using. So if you learn skills such as prompt engineering, it can help provide an edge. Recently, ChatGPT was integrated into products such as Word, PPT, Email Client, and Teams. And knowing how to communicate with AI interfaces within these products can help boost your productivity significantly. And these skills will also help you design intuitive user experience and integrate AI within your products. So these are the seven skills that you can learn to improve your career prospect. By learning fundamentals in this area, you can help provide crucial value to your employers, and that can help you survive and thrive in today's uncertain tech industry. If you'd like to know more about in-demand tech jobs, I've created a video on that. You can click on the top right corner to watch it. Please like, share, and subscribe if you haven't already. And as always, if you have any question, please comment, and I'll try my best to answer them. Thanks.